Uh, thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, and the reason that I'm introducing the next session with uh, Mark Abraham, who, despite the unlikely name, is actually a countryman uh, from, from Ireland, and has started an organization called Shackle. And Shackle is a keyless uh, door opening system for hotels. I think it might be very interesting from an investment perspective. Uh, Here is a, a young man with a young company who actually is doing very well in uh, obtaining uh, investors around the world to invest in what is going to be a very important part of the uh, future of the hotel industry. It's already started in many areas where guests will be actually able to uh, go to their hotel, go straight to the room and open the door of their allocated room uh, on a keyless system. It's working for Mark's company and I will now hand you over to Mark who is with us. I think he's in Lisbon at the moment, is that right? It is, uh, yes. All right, Mark, off you go. Hello. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Gerald. Um, sorry, I can't be there, everyone. Um, I'm in Lisbon right now, so there's another big conference happening called Web Summit. Um, which is the biggest tech conference globally. So uh, we are going through what's called our Series A fundraising right now. Um, so unfortunately, as much as I would have loved to be in there, I've had to prioritize um, being in Lisbon to speak to lots of venture capitalists. Um, but I do have one of my colleagues in, in the audience today. So Katie Rayburn works with, with me at Shackle. So I'm sure Katie can, can give everyone a wave there um, and, and say hello. So yeah, I'll start now with the, uh, I'll just make sure that everything works here. Perfect. Yeah. Okay, super. So yeah, a bit about my background quickly. I know I only have five minutes. So I, I studied hotel management at the Shannon College of Hotel Management. Obviously, Mr. Lawless beside us is, is probably the most famous alumni that we have. And um, I worked operationally across hotels globally. So worked in, in Trump Towers in Chicago, the Sofitel in London, NH Hotels in Brussels. I did everything from cleaning rooms to the night shift to the front desk to F&B. Uh, love my time operationally in hotels. What we're trying to create is the world's first book, stay and explore travel platform. So if you were to think of a brand that owns the book part, you might say booking.com or Expedia. If I was to ask you to think of a company that might own the explore part, you might say get your guide, um, a kluke or amusement. But if I asked you to think of a brand that for your two to three days that you're in a hotel, if you could think of a brand that owns that guest journey, uh, we don't believe there is one yet, and that's ultimately what Shackle is trying to create. If we look at the hotel industry as a glance, because I think you should always focus on the problem that you're fixing rather than the solution you're bringing to the market. I think we've all seen what the online travel agencies have done to the hotel space over the last number of years, and um, taking large commissions, keeping that important guest data and not giving it back to hotels. COVID has obviously been this transformational moment where, you know, removing touch points, making things contactless, and um, removing congestion in the front desk has been truly important. And I know everyone in the UK today, there's a, a huge demand for getting talented staff back into the hotel industry. There's a lot of outstanding positions and we firmly believe that technology can bridge that gap. So if we look at the problem that we're trying to fix today, rather than the macro one, it's how would you remove the need for a front desk to exist if a guest chose to do that? So we're trying to provide a mobile first experience for today's hotel industry. So how could you upload your ID, pre-authorize your payment, check into your hotel, open up your room door, order room service, talk to the front desk through a chatbot, basically a full mobile first experience and I think that's where hotels have to move to if they're to engage with millennials, Gen Zs, your tech native um, users. And that's ultimately what Shackle's trying to solve. And um, I'm sure you've all maybe last night arrived in London and experienced a long check-in time, taking ages to get to your room. And we believe that should be a digital experience. And this is the solution that we're bringing. So anything that you can think that you would want to do digitally, with your own mobile, we want to give that offering to you within your hotel stay. Um, and I kind of mentioned that before, from check-in to check-out, to open up your room, to order in room service. I'm sure many hoteliers are getting fed up of all the Uber Eats and Deliveroo drivers taking over their lobbies right now. We think that order in room service guest experience should be much more seamless through your own mobile. Um, the solution on the hotel side is just a dashboard. This is obviously the first time the hotel space has gone from a physical touch point to a digital touch point. So it's showcasing what's happening on the mobile experience for the hotel staff. 
Um, we've achieved a lot of things in the last couple of months. So we did our seed round in, in May. We raised two and a half million dollars. And we're in the process of we're doing our Series A round. So we're raising $15 million this month. And we've lots of great interest from in some of the top venture capital funds around the world, uh, who I'm all meeting this week uh, down in Lisbon. We've built a full in-house engineering team out of Amsterdam. We've signed up some incredible advisors like Mr. Lawless and, and Floor Bleeker from Accor. And we did some great deals down in Dubai with the police where we can take a photo of the passport and send it directly to the CID rather than them scanning it at the front desk. Um, and we've signed up over 74 hotels. And this has now gone to over 100 hotels in the last four months. So uh, things are, are moving quite rapidly, um, but it's super exciting for us. Uh, the team has, has got a great um, breakdown of both technology experience. We've got some of the earliest employees at Uber, at Babylon Health, um, at micromobility companies like Dot. Um, obviously, Katie, who's in the audience, went to the Shannon College of Hotel Management and did her MIT at the Rosewood. So it's a great breakdown of technology experience with hospitality experience. Um, obviously, I mentioned Gerald. He's been an incredible help to myself. Um, Floor from Accor, the group CTO. Um, Brad is the founder of Lime. You might use the micromobility scooters across London today. And Conrad actually built Uber's very first app. Um, and, and Conrad and, and Brad are current investors in Shackle. The funding to date, so we've raised $2.8 million. We have angel investors from Revolut, from Uber, from Lime, and from Enishmore, the Hoxton collaboration. Uh, Frontline Ventures led our, our last round. Um, and as I said, we've moved into our Series A fundraising this week, um, where we're looking to raise over $15 million. Um, and we currently have a number of offers on the table. So it's a, a really, really exciting time for all of us at Shackle. Uh, and yeah, that's my, my five minutes. I think I'm 10 seconds over, so hopefully Gerald won't give out to me. Um, really appreciate your time. Um, hope everyone enjoys the conference. Sorry I can't be there, um, but Katie, who's in the audience, will, will hopefully answer any questions. And, and please feel to reach out to me on LinkedIn um, if you'd like to talk further. So uh, Gerald, I'm not sure if I'm handing it back over to you, uh, but thanks so much for your time.